forecast. Good afternoon, everyone. Just want to give you a quick look at what we're expecting for the day. We're expecting mostly cloudy conditions as we get into the evening. We'll see those clouds start to clear out a bit as we go into overnight into early morning with some breezy conditions. Fortunately, we're looking at temperatures in the upper 60s, near 70 for a lot of the area. Charlottesville Airport, though, we're sitting mostly cloudy, 62 degrees, and we started off the day that way, mostly cloudy. And fortunately, we're going to be sitting very warm, although we are going to be a bit breezy and cloudy. It's going to be a very mild day, similar to yesterday, 65 at the Shenandoah Valley Airport and mostly cloudy as well. Across the region, we're looking at temperatures in the 60s. Some areas still struggling to get into the 60s, but they'll make it there. Uh, we're going to have some areas get as high as the low 70s, um, so it's going to be a warm day overall. Here's a look at a large system that we have that's coming through. Fortunately, most of that is not going to be affecting us at all. If you take a closer look, we're looking at cloud coverage. I mean, any of the, most of the showers look like they're going to be staying well to the north, although we're not ruling out the possibility of a stray shower making its way into central Virginia, but we're going to be remaining mostly dry and cloudy for today. As for our highs today, mostly cloudy and breezy temperatures in the upper 60s and low 70s. Some areas will actually get to the 70s today, so it's going to be a warm one. And tonight, clouds are going to be decreasing. We're still going to see those breezy conditions, but we're going to be uh, seeing clouds decrease just a bit as we get into tomorrow morning and temperatures in the just a range of 40s, mid 40s to upper 40s. Some areas maybe even hitting the low 50s. And tomorrow we'll have sun and clouds with temperatures quite warm again, maybe not as warm as today, but we're still going to be sitting in the 60s for many areas. Now here's a look at winds for the day. You can see that we have really, really strong winds uh, in in some areas, especially in the upper elevations in the upper 30s. Now along the Blue Ridge, there is an advisory out for winds up to 50 miles, up to and above 50 miles per hour. So it's going to be a strong, windy day, but most areas in central Virginia are looking at winds up to about 30 miles per hour. And as you go into the day, you can see that really continues. It tapers down a bit, but we're still looking at gusty winds throughout the entire day. And by 10 p.m., we're still sitting with areas with wind gusts in the upper 20s. Uh, as we go into tomorrow, we can see uh, that frontal passage or the, that cold front moving through as we see a shift in the winds. We also see Tim, uh, uh, gust start to calm down a bit, but tomorrow could still be a bit breezy. We're just going to see that uh, that directional change. Here's a look at the next system we have coming through. Really mostly cloudy right now. Again, a chance for a stray shower. And as we go into tomorrow morning, we're looking at mostly sunny conditions, but those clouds are going to move right back in and tomorrow is going to be sun in and out. Predicted rainfall through Saturday, almost negligible, almost nothing. Some areas could see up to half an inch, but it's not going to be much. It's not going to be until Sunday that we're really tracking the next chance for a system. And we're going to see maybe starting off with maybe some mixing and snow, but most of it's going to be rain. It won't be until late evening that we're looking at another chance for maybe some wintry mixing. And most of that looks like it's going to be staying in the upper elevations, but we keep it, we'll be keeping an eye on that. Today, 66 to 70, mostly cloudy and breezy. This evening, 44 to 50, clouds decreasing. And tomorrow, 59 to 64, sun and clouds. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. 70 today, beautiful, just a bit gray. We're going to see those gray conditions through the weekend. Temperatures drop on Saturday and Sunday. We are tracking a chance for some early mixing and maybe even some snow. Dryden.